The more you trust God, the quicker and easier you will see your prayers coming true. He loves us all. He is the most powerful. He is the most beautiful. He knows everything about us. He created us. If if you have faith in your prayers then the power of the universe will work for you. Always keep one thing in mind. Our subconscious mind makes true only those things which we ask it to do. Hence repeat in your subconscious mind the same thoughts which you tell yourself. Sometimes people become so angry with their life that they start considering themselves unlucky and complain to God about this. In such a situation, people should understand that God does not put obstacles in their path. Instead of doubting God, you should have faith in God and also keep one thing in mind that never have two thoughts in your mind at the same time. If you want your thoughts to work properly then have one thought for that. But it is important to focus at one time only. Praying is not just about asking for something from God. By praying, you not only manifest physical things but you also grow spiritually, you get peace and success. Today we are going to talk about techniques in prayer therapy book which has been written by Joseph Murphy. From this book we will learn about the power of prayer which you can use in your life. This book is a manual which explains how to pray, how to make prayer a daily activity and how to use prayer when any trouble arises. According to author Murphy, prayer is always yours in times of trouble. Also, to make prayer an integral and creative part of your life, you will not have to wait for any problem and you can easily concentrate on praying, but before that you get lost in the spiritual world of this prayer. If you have come to our channel for the first time then do subscribe to the channel. Our channel is one of the YouTube Zero channels. Our videos may sometimes be a little long because we never compromise on the quality of the book and content, hence the videos are short. It is very important to see till the end, so let's start again and understand the power of prayer in detail. Do you know how to pray? It is important that you pray. You must have seen many people praying, for someone in your family or relative. A person prays for recovery, a soldier prays for success, a soldier prays for victory in a war, a pilot prays to God for his successful emergency landing, but praying only when needed is not enough. We advise you to stop and pray. With this, you can make prayer a source that can do miracles in your life. It can bring success in life. Prayer can make you capable of helping yourself as well as others. Prayer can be done only by our asking. You don't get it, it is important to have faith. The more you have faith in God, the quicker and easier you will see your prayers coming true. In reality, what we want is prayer. We all want happiness, prosperity, security and peace of mind. We want some of which we get and some we don't. It is all related to faith. When you pray, a message comes in the universe which is connected to your willpower. Now the more you desire to get that thing, the more you will be able to achieve it. Soon you will see your prayer coming true. When you are praying, you are creating a picture of your desired thing in the universal creative mind which accepts it and when you start accepting the desired thing is true in life. She starts coming towards you creative law knows how to make what you want come true that's why you should pray effectively let's know effective ways to pray have faith in God true faith in God for what you want pray keeping this in mind so that God will definitely fulfill your prayers. Think about the goodness of God. Think about the greatness of God. Think about his holiness. Like God is the most intelligent. He loves us all. He is the most powerful. God is the most beautiful. He knows everything about us who created us. Doing this some time a day will strengthen your faith in God and you will start feeling that God is helping you invisibly in solving the problems as we know them. It is known that prayer works very effectively, but do you know that prayer can be so effective that through it you can cure any disease of your life? Actually prayer depends on our faith, which means that if, if you wish to be cured with full faith then you can be cured through prayer. Simply put, spiritual education is an intelligent work which depends on our conscious and subconscious mind. If you really want to be cured then you should you should know how you are praying, that is, the way you pray will increase the possibility of your recovery. The first thing you have to remember for treatment is that your mind has a dual nature. There is a constant thought in the subconscious mind. On repetition, they turn into reality. Apart from this, the subconscious mind has complete control over your body. If you want to get well then you have to say to yourself, I have faith in the power of God and I will get well. In this way, control your thoughts. By repeating it repeatedly in your mind, your subconscious mind will convert these thoughts into reality. Overall, it is most important to have faith in the power of God. 
If you have faith in your prayers, then the power of the universe should work for you to protect yourself. The first rule is to trust. It is easier to maintain good health and cure the disease than to bring disease into the body. Your way of thinking decides your disease, meaning if you think that you are fine and you get any disease. If it doesn't happen then the same thing will happen and you can keep yourself away from diseases, so trust in prayer and get rid of your diseases. Many of us often feel weak and they keep saying to themselves that no one will help me. In this way they remain unhappy with their own thoughts. We all have the power to think negatively and positively and even when someone else says something, we become unhappy only when we think about those things mentally. In simple words, we are completely free to think good or bad. It is our choice as to what we will think and how we will think. Our subconscious mind works on those things which we believe. And it has been said many times that whatever we think in our subconscious mind, the same thing happens to us, in other words, the things we believe in become our reality and because we have the choice to choose our thoughts, there is freedom, so choose only good thoughts as much as possible so that you can improve your health. When you think thoughts of being healthy, then these thoughts spread in your body and mind which helps you in recovering completely. Similarly, think well about everything related to yourself and choose only good thoughts. Replace your negative thoughts with positive thoughts and use prayer. When you choose happiness and health in your mind, then prayer is true. It works for you. If you want to change your health, then for that you will have to recognize the power of prayer and use it. For this you just have to change your negative attitude because negative attitude spoils your health as well as your relationship. To avoid this, you should pray for good health and progress. To do this, pray like this. I pray that I work for health, happiness, peace and promotion. My boss is happy with my work. I see this picture. I always have it in my mind and I know it will come true I am a loving and kind person and I treat everyone with integrity the way I want to be treated God's power is my guidance and I am better in every work of mine. Now do this prayer daily and you can get very good results very soon. Keep in mind that whatever you imagine to become, you have an emotional response to it which makes your imagination come true. It proves the truth, so keep doing such positive prayers daily and you can finally feel the good changes. You must have often heard people saying that pray, this means that people have a lot of faith in the power of God. And they believe that he will do better for them, so to bring better changes in your life, pray with a true heart and think positive, in this way you can bring the best changes in your life, we all know this very well. When and at what place we should pray, we know which things can work better for us by praying. Simply put, we have created a limitation on our prayers, so we often pray only on those things. We pray for what we think will work for us but if you want to learn to pray for guidance then you have to keep yourself away from limitations. You have to understand that there is no limit to praying. You can pray for everything in every sense. Every one of us has some desire which we want to fulfill, like if you want to become something then that is your desire and those desires are fulfilled. To do this you have to work, only then you can fulfill your desire. For this, while fulfilling your desires, deal with the obstacles that come in your way and keep moving forward. It is told in the Bible that you should choose today. Whom will you serve because we can stop choosing health happiness peace of mind and endangering poverty and limitation and we will choose the strength within us after which you can say I choose happiness peace prosperity knowledge and security and the moment we we keep these thoughts in our conscious mind, then our subconscious mind turns our thoughts into truth, that means we get our guidance from our subconscious mind which tries as much as possible to make our thoughts true, always keep one thing in mind. Our subconscious mind makes only those things come true which we tell it to do, so repeat in your subconscious mind only those thoughts which you want to see in your life and in the same way, keep moving forward in your life with good thoughts. We face many obstacles in life that stop us from reaching our goals, but the question is how do these obstacles arise? Actually, these problems occur in our own minds and as we do, our subconscious mind solves them. Works on things that we ask it to do so when you think that your work cannot be completed properly or there may be some problem in it then it turns out to be true just like this and you get help in your work. Problems start arising. To remove these obstacles, you have to create harmony between your conscious and subconscious mind. When both of them work together, then your subconscious mind pays more attention to your wishes and thoughts and those thoughts. To complete the work, you start working faster. You should focus on working without interruption. When you think such thoughts in your mind, 
Then those thoughts reach your subconscious mind and your subconscious mind helps in making these thoughts true. In addition, use these steps to remove blockages and pray effectively. Quiet your mind and, if possible, lie down to rest. Make a statement that you will repeat over and over again. You can repeat several times like I am feeling completely at peace and I thank myself for this peace and repeat this again and again in your mind. Repeat these words out loud to stop the mind from wandering. And really feel these words. Now keep repeating these words in your mind or rapidly for 5 minutes or more so that your subconscious mind will respond quickly to these things. Use these steps just before sleeping and close your eyes. Stop and imagine a friend or close relative in front of you. Imagine that they are congratulating you for your success. Meaning, the more you get congratulated for your success, the more beneficial it can be for you. Use of this technique can be do it three or four times a day as well as use this technique just before going to bed at night and finally imagine your thing, in this way you can move towards success in your life without any hindrance. There are some people who have done something wrong with us, due to which we are not able to forgive them or we are unable to forgive ourselves for our mistakes, although it is a little difficult to forgive but through the prayer we are forgiving ourselves and we can forgive others and we should do this because when we do not learn to forgive, we make a feeling of hatred towards others and ourselves, these feelings of hatred are not good for our health and life it happens because we only pay attention to the evils of others with hatred. Due to which we deviate from the goals of our life, so we should learn to forgive, sometimes people get so angry with their life that they consider themselves unlikely it seems and complains to God. In such a situation, people should understand that God does not interrupt their way instead of doubting God. You should trust God and say to yourself that I know that God I know that God from me they love a lot, they are everyone's keepers and cares for me, I guide me and inspire me. This body is a blessing for me that I have met God. I know God knows God the best for me and the way to heaven it is hidden inside me, which means that you are very powerful and you have complete ability to complete your work, which no one can stop you from completing and all the qualities of God are in my subconto. I can do anything and I always keep moving forward. With repeating these things, you can forgive many times a day and finally you can forgive with peace, along with one thing to keep in mind that any time in your mind do not bring two thoughts on time. If you want your thoughts to work properly, then it is necessary for him to focus on a time at a time. Arun can take a quick step to make your thoughts come true and if someone does something wrong with you or you make a mistake, then learn to forgive for that mistake because you are through your mind through your mind you can move beyond positivity by removing negative feelings, similarly use your creativity and can remove the differences of husband and wife from the appearance moving forward in your life. Connects and distributes hatred and when you together with your partner study the rules of God's idol's life and prayer to God, everything can be possible, which you might have given up hope if you think if you think your relationship your partner has increased very much and now there is no chance of recovering this relationship, so it is not so at all, you can overcome the problem that comes in your relationship through prayer and can improve your relationship. Keep in mind that we humans are mental and emotionally associated with God, God is the name of love, so to cure any relationship, one should use the power of God to do so with his full heart to do this with his partner pray with God, God will improve your relationship in return, meaning your subconscious mind will change your mind in reality. If both of you and your partner are inspired by love and honesty, then God's love is loved by your partner do and you can get away from your problem forever. If you want that you and your partner are not defeated, then for this you need to choose the right partner. Create types of thoughts like I know that there is a person who is waiting to spend his life with me. I know he loves me and I can work for his happiness, we both are happy together the beach remains in the middle and we understand each other very well and when you repeat these thoughts, you are sending these thoughts to the universe through the mind and thus you can get the same partner in return in return it is the partner that you imagine as well as use these steps to keep your marriage safe. So keep in mind that you start a happy life with your partner, praise your partner for the goodness, if you get a good morning breakfast, praise your partner for him and tell them thank you to your partner show love to tell them how much you love them and work for their happiness, keep in mind that you do not feel bad and if this happens, then apologize to them immediately for your mistake, in this way using these steps you can improve your relationship and can do good to your marriage. We are one of the biggest enemies of humans when there is a fear of some work in your life, then it is very difficult to complete that work. Go goes to use the prayer to deal with your fear. Prayer means to rely directly in God and everything about God is good that removes your fear. Fear is the cloud that loves you to God in today's time. 
People are afraid of ghost devils and failure and this fear makes a human being uncertainly. This is the fear that makes us an angry and irritable person and makes a bad human relationship through fear. People are so afraid of criticism that many of their beautiful thoughts never come to see them to overcome the fear. Go ahead, the only way to overcome fear is to face fear. If you are afraid of something, then you will get away from facing it, because you will know that the thing you were afraid of was really for you it was not dangerous, so to overcome your fear, do everything that makes you afraid and gradually I am going to control my fear, I now speak with peace and confidence, I am with my fear I am going to emerge and now I am not afraid of fear of my life when you calm your mind in this way and try to overcome that fear, then you can finally remove your fear. Remember you remember you to overcome the fear, you have to trust God and when your fear is overcome, you can move forward without stopping in your life, if you want to calm your mind, then you have to make your mind with a physical dispute of noise and restlessness negative feelings should stay away from concerns and stress as you have seen how many special teachers are adept at maintaining internal peace, through which he always calmly and convey his thoughts to others, so calm and so use sufficient atmosphere this can prove to be very useful for you because when you do peace, in peace, it becomes very easy to meditate on your thoughts, so remove your mind from the thoughts of waste and just on that thought note what you really want to do, Although many types of thoughts keep coming to the mind and those things can be due to the affair around you because if something is going on around you, then obviously your mind will wander and you will wander and you instead of focusing on your own thoughts, you will start focusing on others' thoughts, so find a quiet place to perform a calm place. In this way you can focus well on your own thoughts and your subconscious mind soon changes those thoughts as soon as possible to remove the distraction will work for the necessary work. Start thinking about the thoughts like peace and happiness and keep in mind that what you speak completely, then you can go and search your thoughts only then only then you can search because the subconscious mind works quickly on the thoughts that you repeat repeatedly. It means that you will have to accept your desires, only then you can go to your conceived and subconscious mind synchronize and your conceives and subconscious mind you're the wise can be your thoughts agree by agreeing with you can make it true, but if you fail, then you have to keep performing your prayers and in the same way you can fulfill your desires through the prayer. Always keep in mind one thing, whatever we believe in the truth or feel they do that he reaches our subconscious mind and you control all the parts of your mind, so keep in mind what you say firmly to yourself. Like you, you should pray while maintaining confidence in the power of your God, your God's power is present in you as your subconscious mind, which will come true to everything that you repeated in your mind, so in your life to get good results, think only good thoughts, they say that the seed is not the same, so keep the same kind of thoughts in your mind and think well, in this way you will get the best results in your desires. To make it come true, do a daily prayer thank you friends, this was the book of Technic in Pray Therapy, in this book, you have known about the power of the prayer, using which you can be successful by removing all the problems of your life by removing all the problems of your life. The subconscious mind helps you to be successful, so if you want to be successful in your life, then trust God, prayer. There is no fixed way to perform prayer. Those whom you want to see and we want to see, we expect God to listen to all your prayers and give you everything you want from the heart. If you like this video very much, then please comment and tell us by commenting an hour before moving on the next video. Subscribe to this channel, this keeps your love consistently and our videos reach a lot of people, they get it quickly and thank you so much with more videos.